up everyone, Tim Allen Jr. here, My Own Asylum Alcohol. Today, I'm trying two new flavors that I haven't ever tried. I'm not a big fan of grape, um, but I have tried one brand, but I have not tried this flavor. Now with Mike's. It got harder and then hard, I think. Anyways, um, today I'm going to try this new flavor to myself called Purple Grape. Um, this is a 8% alcohol per volume. And uh, let's get right into it. Um, Give her a go. See what it. See what the flavor is like. Just has a nice grape scent to it, like right, right up, right off the vine scent. I'm joking, but still. Mm. I'll go ahead and say mm, tastes like a grape soda. Easily chuggable. It's really not too bad. It tastes just like grape soda. You can power it down if you want. Or enjoy it. Um I think it's like a dollar fifty, dollar sixty, something like that. With a deposit. Anyways, it's really not that bad. You can chug it. Uh, yeah. It's really not bad. I might actually bite it. Mmm. I'm gonna go ahead and give it a An eight for pricing versus alcohol content and flavor wise I'm gonna give her a I'm gonna give her an eight as well it's not bad I would uh, foresee buying it in the future but knowing me I probably won't ever buy it again but it's actually really good so if anyone likes grape soda flavor um, what is it kale who likes grape soda I do. <laughs> Anyways, he, he gets older, he, you know, he tries this, he's like, yeah. Anyways, whatever. <laughs> Next up, I got a, a brand I've never tried before. <clears throat> a guy that I work with, um, he drinks these. Not sure about the flavor he drinks, but I know he drinks this brand. And as far as I know, this is his go-to, so. This is a four loco. This one here is a sour grape, which is a 14% alcohol per volume. Much bigger can compared to this one. I'm pretty sure I paid $2.50 for this, somewhere around there. Does not smell like grape. It smells like it smells like a septic tank. You know when you walk into like a fucking porter potty and you just get that overwhelming stench of shit. That's what that smells like. All right, let's dive into this. Okay, um, it's 
not bad. It's not. I definitely wouldn't drink more than one of these. Because <laughs> it's like taking a shot of vodka, orange or grape vodka. A cheap grape vodka you get from Bennett's, I think. Um, shit's gonna fuck you up. Uh, pretty good. Um, I'm not. Like I said, I'm not uh, familiar with this. I haven't drank it before. And then say that it's going to give you a nice fucking hangover. If you chug all of this. I'm sure you're going to feel like shit after you drink this thing. Uh, holy fuck. All right. Damn. It tastes like straight vodkas in this. I added just a tiny bit of grape flavor to it. Uh, oh, okay. I'm going to give it a 10 for getting you fucked up. Okay? So if you're on a budget and you want to fucking forget the world for an evening, this motherfucker right here is the way to go. Uh, I will finish it. Maybe, but it's fucking strong. Um, alcohol per volume per price. It's a ten. It's a ten. It's gonna do what it needs to do and get you fucked up. Um, I will never buy it again because it tastes like shit. It's not my thing. But a lot of you guys out there. Fucking fruit fly in my house for some reason. I got a pretty fucking clean house. So when I see somebody like that flying around, there's something somewhere that's accumulating. Anyways, back to my review. It's not bad. So any of you guys hardcore get fucked up on a regular basis. This is your go-to. Uh, so when the liquor stores are closed, you guys want something hard that's going to fuck you up, I recommend grab one of these motherfuckers. Because it will do what it needs it to do. Um, head to head, if I was going to purchase this again, I would always go with Mike's Harder. Uh, so it's almost half of what this one is and a little bit cheaper and you can drink three of these to probably accumulate for one of these. Um, I would go with this because overall because it tastes better and if I want to like moderate my evening and not for it to get warm and whatever this is the one I would do. This one here, it would take me, yeah, I'd probably chug the shit out of it just because it tastes so bad. But anyways, I'm going to go for Mike's Purple Grape for the win over Four Locos Sour Grape. Uh, anyways, for all you drunks out there, mm, man. Have a good night, have a good evening, and fuck off. Continue drinking, my friends.